Okay, so this is my uh, W King 50 watt speaker. It's unbelievable the quality of the sound from this. Uh, to give you an idea, if you've got a Sonos system, I've got the Sonos 1, 3, and 5 speakers. This is definitely as good as the Sonos 3, um, not quite as loud as the Sonos 5, but honestly, you, you are not going to get the benefit of the sound on this video. I can only tell you it is absolutely fantastic. Um, so I'm going to go through the operation of it, uh, how to link it through Bluetooth, etc. And then we'll do some audio. But as I said, you're not going to get the benefit. It is absolutely astounding. There's no distortion at the top end. You've got a, a graphic e equaliser on it. <clears throat> Actually, sorry, it's not a graphic equaliser. Uh, it, what it does is it um, it just highlights the um, the treble or the bass um, or the voice. It, it's not really state of the art. You press it and you'll hear the change. You can't see anything. Um, on the top, if we have a quick look, you can see the buttons. You've got a reset pin here. Um, if you want to disconnect it from Bluetooth devices uh, and you don't want to use the Bluetooth device to do it, you can just pop a pin in there. So if you're at a party and you quickly want to use somebody else's phone for different music, if you press that, uh, it's easy to disconnect a Bluetooth device and uh, connect another one up. You've got your on-off button there, your plus and minus. Now, this is for volume up and down, yeah, or track backwards and forwards. You've got your play and your stop. And as I say, that changes the, um, works similar to a graphic equalizer, but there's no graphics on it. If we spin it onto the back and bring it up to the camera, you've got, if we open there, three ports. Uh, that's for your audio auxiliary input. So you can connect it to another device. And I've tried this against uh, one of my Sonos, um, I think it's Sonos Connect, where you can um, use Sonos to connect to another speaker. This is your charging point here, and it's a USB-C. So it's a quicker charge than normal. Don't forget, you've got a big battery in here. You've got up to 24 hours uh, use on it. Uh, and then here's your, your normal USB connector. And that's where you want to charge other devices up. So if you're out and about and you're not near any uh, mains ports, then you can use this to charge your phone up or anything else that accepts USB charging. And then that just clips over there to give it a little bit of uh, waterproofing. You've obviously got your carry strap as well. And there's two subwoofers in here, um, obviously one at either end. Now, if I pop that down, I'll show you how to connect it. Right, so first things first, if you just press the on button, it doesn't turn on, but it does show you the charge that's in the battery. So this is fully charged, this. Um, obviously, as it counts down, when you get to two batteries on, you've got up to 66% in. And then when you've got one light in, you've got up to 33% um, in. Uh, all lights up to 100% charge. So if we just press the button, it turns on. And if you haven't got a device that's connected, what you should see, that starts to flash. And then on my S10 Plus, it's automatically come up to purr. So if we just press OK, right, I'm purred now. And if we go into music, entertainment. Right, now that's playing. Let me just pause it and see if I can find something else. The Manic Monday by the Bangles. Now I'm going to move the camera away and we'll we'll turn it up so that you can hear it. But honestly, it is phenomenal. Right, so I'm connected. I'm on Spotify and it's simply a case of You bring my veins, girl, you yeah, that was at full volume. Obviously, you can control it from your phone or you can control it from the unit. If you 
take it down and use this anywhere. Now, I'm going to be doing some building work and I'm going to be using it outside while that's going on. But it's an absolutely fantastic piece of kit. Um, something else that I like about it as well, when you go into your gluten settings, it actually tells you your uh, remaining battery on your Bluetooth settings. So currently this is at 100% because I've just charged it. But all in all, a really, really good device.